If you guys want to see what we have in our backyard and our precious plants in our backyards, we have both ornamental, uh, cacti, CNS stuff, and we also have caladium. Nothing special about it though. A lot of people have caladium, but I am willing to show you that if you guys stay tuned and watch this video till the end. One, two, three! In today's video, sa video natin ngayong araw na to, magha-harvest ako ng talbos ng kamuting kahoy. I will be harvesting some cassava leaves because we don't have ulam, wala kaming viand for tonight. So, magha-harvest tayo dito sa likod ng bahay natin. I will be harvesting some cassava leaves at the back of our house. I have here a bucket. It's a not really clean bucket, but we will wash the cassava leaves anyway. You guys are curious about the flower of bok choy or pechay. May bulaklak ang pechay ko ngayon. So, ipapakita ko siya sa inyo. I have a flower of bok choy and I will show you how it looks like. Sa mga curious dyan, since I'm doing this and I'm like in the garden, if you want to see everyone, that is the flower of pechay. Look. I don't know if you can see that clearly. So, I planted some pechay on my pulley bags and now I'm putting them here. And it's not the only one. This one Oh, I'm sorry about the cow though. This one. Those are my pecha and we will collect the cassava leaves right over there. Basically, we will just collect the pop. Let me show you guys. It's a painstaking process, but right now we will just do the collecting. And I think I will cook them later. So what we need to get is this one. So kailangan natin kumuha ng talbos. Okay. This one, you have to look carefully on the color you have to be aware of the color these ones are green these ones are green these are old leaves so you have to look for something like grayish green leaves that is what we are going to collect and that is what we are going to eat i know that there's a lot of provinces here in the philippines that they actually eat this one I will be showing you what we could make with this one later. I will make salad. So guys, if you want to know how I will cook that one or how I make salad made of cassava leaves, you should comment that down below so I would know if you really like to see that video or you don't. Okay guys, I will leave you right here while I harvest some cassava leaves over there. And after this harvesting stuff, we're gonna do a little tour in our backyard on what we can see in our backyard. This is like a, not a very huge backyard, but there's like decent plenty of plants around so okay I'm gonna get back to harvest so guys we are done harvesting the cassava leaves and this is what we have it's not a lot actually it's like this size when I squeeze them together to make them a salad but it would be enough for dinner we will basically just like so there we just have to equally divide it on how many individual that we have here in the house so as promised just like I promised you that I will be showing you some of the stuff and plants in the house or in our backyard we are just going to do that. I'm going to give you a little bit of a tour. See you guys ready. So guys, here we are in our Caladium area or Caladium area. I'm not really sure about their ID, so you guys should like correct me if I'm wrong. But seriously, just take a look and I don't know what their IDs are. They said that one is this one is tequila sunrise and this one is watermelon, I'm not sure. And they said that it's angel wings, angel wings. And I don't know, this one is starburst. I'm not really sure so you guys should like correct me if I'm wrong and that one is like strawberry something something and then this one is Filipina I don't know and that one is turtle back I'm, sure, I'm sure that it's turtle back that is one of my favorite it's taro and this one is uh, red barret I'm um, right well it doesn't look like a red barret look that one that leaves looks like a red barret and these are natives I don't know what they are and those are Oh gosh, I don't really know. I don't really know their IDs. I, I, I just hope I know. And that one is Florida Spring, I think. And that one is Sexy Pink. That didn't really grow from the ground. 
it has been like that okay the mother has been like that too and this one is I some some someone that I don't really know so there you go and there is our caladium area but we also have another caladiums in other parts of the house that we should go check out next so here we have this mariposa and that one is they call that lipstick here this one is Thai Beauty I think and this one is red spider and this one is I'm not actually sure what the idea is those are quite new ones though and we also have that's a turtle vine that's strawberry and strawberry and that's dracaena didn't grow much don't know what to do with it we also have this lilies who haven't flowered yet and that is some gorgeous variegated grass that I have to trim they're really gorgeous I don't know what these are but yeah they're they're plants and here's some aglos and stuff you guys if you guys notice that those were like common aglos kind of don't know their names and those are the bromeliads together with this ones our plants aren't expensive though we don't buy expensive plants and this one those are also bromeliads and this one is also a really gorgeous bromeliads and those and a matter of thousands i think <laughs> if i'm right that's a mother of thousands and we also have Kalidim here who had been on a pot with mr galatea right here who's like a huge one in my profile picture i really love that plant i really appreciate that plant and here is beside that there's a dumb cane differentia area together with this bananas i don't know they're like bananas and those stuff too this one many people has interest in this one but we're not selling that i'm sorry and here's some variegated calamansi so if you guys know we have variegated calamansi even the fruits is actually variegated so that is some gorgeous plant right here we don't have beautiful pots because pots are kind of expensive here and there it goes they're like huge And that one is Antorium. Those are also Alocasia and Alocasia and some Peace Lily and stuff. And those are Cryptanthus. And I have this on the table. I haven't planted it yet. I pulled it from somewhere there and I think I'm going to plant it on the... I'm going to put it on a stump or a branch or something. And that's a mosquito on it that came from, that come from uh, Barangay. We have that for malaria. It will... Uh, protection for malaria. They issued that once a year, but somehow they issued it like after two years, I think. And here are some more differentia and aglos. There you go. Here are also aglonemas. That's a soxum, I think, jaipong. And there, and uh, what's that? <laughs> I think that's a. Oh gosh, I keep on forgetting. They said. It's um never mind. Those are aglos. That's pink valentine. A rui, a stardust. This one is stardust. And this one is I don't know what it's called, but yeah. Let me just like take a photo of that. And this one is a boxer. And this one is Lucky Red, I think. No, 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 that's Rui. I don't know where the Lucky Red is. And we also have guava here and some all very trees and stuff and fern. And that is our succulent house. That's where we put our, su our succulent. If you guys want to see what's inside of that succulent house, you should also comment that down below in, uh, in this video, <laughs> okay? I'm, I am willing to show you what is inside of that succulent house if you if I would just know that you like it or you would like to see it or not so there you go guys I'm gonna go make dinner and if you like this video give it a thumbs up and comment down below if you want to see how I make salad with this cassava leaves and if you want to see what's inside the succulent house you could also like subscribe to my channel by clicking the subscription down below click the notification bell beside the subscription button and click also you will be updated on my next video i have a lot to show you and you guys have to see that i'll see you guys on my next video bye, -bye.